Is this game just prehistoric Stardew Valley with ancient humans? Let's find out. I am Mad Morph, and welcome to my first week playing Roots of Patcher, edited down into this playthrough for you. Whilst I'm creating my character here, I will tell you that there is much more to this game than meets the eye. I think it focuses a lot more on story, relationships, and has a way more easygoing and laid back pace than what I've experienced with my playthroughs of Stardew Valley. And I think that makes for a perfect, cozy, and relaxing video. So let's jump in together to Roots of Patcher. Please do be sure to hit like and subscribe if you're new here, and let me know in a comment if you enjoy this video. Let's get started. New Year's Eve. Our first winter in this new land is almost over. The clan is coming back home from the mountaintop. Bloody hell, my son's a uh, emo. <laughs> Where does the time go? It's hard to believe your rite of passage is so soon. It still feels like we found you only yesterday. What? I thought it was your son. No. I bet you'll have the coolest totem of everyone. Maybe. I can sense. There's something different about you, even right now. I don't want the winter festival to be over. I'm not ready to go to bed. One more story, please. All right, just one more. Tell the story of how we got here. I like the way you tell it. Back when the summer sun still warmed our skin, it was time to pick the day for the next rite of passage. Vuk, our great shaman, asked the spirits and got a strange answer. You must move, they demanded. No normal person should ever question the spirits, but our Vuk is no normal person. Why, he asked. You need to find a tree far in the east, the spirit said. Only danger awaits you here, here, here. But we didn't know of any pacha trees to the east. This gave our leader a difficult dilemma. Do we travel into unknown lands or risk disobeying the spirits? But there was one thing he could always depend on. The clam. We packed up everything and walked. We walked and walked. Soon the leaves began changing colors, and we still hadn't found a tree. Cold and tired, we traveled through the savannah, unsure how much further we could walk. Our shaman is strong, but not infallible. Could he have made a mistake as we were making camp? The earth shook. Man, look at Grandma shaking it up there on the platform. The ground groaned a terrible sound as the trees threatened to topple. There was no doubt this was a powerful sign. But for what? The way we had come was blocked. Winter was too close to go back. The clan did what it did best. We worked together. Some built our homes, while others gathered food for the winter. Vak walked away from the group. Not seeing his absence, Morphe followed him into a nearby forest. I'm just nosy, apparently. Our shaman was distraught. How could he make everyone leave their homes only to be trapped in a strange land? But then... They saw it. Tree, 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 tree. This music's a bop. We were home, we were home. Roots of Patcha, we were home. As we did, we were little, little, little. Grandma playing the flute. Just cut back to her on the platform, proper jamming out and like. Blowing it. <laughs> Waking up. 
it makes sense I was found, let's be honest. I am the absolute palest of the pale here with my black hair and my kiss makeup. <laughs> oh, it's the weird kid we found under a gooseberry bush again. Hello! Uh, you're up, hello. It's finally spring. Spring has sprung. Hay fever sufferers everywhere. Despair. I know it's a different idea, but I, I think it'll work. We could grow food from wild seeds right here in these fields. They just need a little clearing. Or a lot. Or, or a lot. I wish I could be out there with you, but my bones aren't what they used to be. I'm sure you'll find a way to help you, Grok. You always do. Thanks, sister. I think so, too. I would help. It's my back, darling. <laughs> da, da, we're in. Was da. Seeds, tools, items, inventory, smoke signals, map, actions. Judo chop. So wait. Ah, so we hit tab to change what is equipped. And with my stone tool, I shall clear this farm like no one has cleared a farm ever before, sir. When you found me, I was but a babe in a bush. Now I am a young man ready to set right the ills of this world to grow seed. Watch me, stepfather, surrogate father. What would I call a father, the adopted father? Don't call me father. Oh. Watch me, daddy. No, definitely don't do that. Okay. Watch me, Igrok. <laughs> I guess I'll start my clearing this area. Wait, what's my journal saying? Find wild seeds, plant and care for them, pick their precious yield in a few days. Okay. Ooh, look at the map. The clan's preparing for the rite of passage tomorrow. Talk to the clan. Zero of 27. I gotta to talk to 27 people. My social battery shall be entirely spent. I can only handle about three conversations a day, and I need to have a little lie down. In a dark room. <laughs> Scroll TikTok for an hour or two. Check my Instagram notifications and just, you know, shut the world out for a bit. I wonder if I can get rid of these rocks yet. Let's see. Nice. Our first prehistoric farm, even though it's technically not real prehistoric, cause it's not based on anyone, it's a made up land, it's fine. You just know the people who made the game thought, listen, if we try and claim this is real human history or base it on anything, people are gonna pick holes in it. They're gonna tell us we're wrong, cause that's what people do on the internet these days. All extra science made up. Oh, hello. Tear is excited about this new land and all the resources this season brings. Talk to her. Okay, so did I find any seeds? Maybe I, uh... Ha 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 ha! Carrot seed. Gather seeds from wild plants by harvesting them. Using your hand axe, clear the fields, till the soil to prepare the land for planting. Select a seed from your seed bag, plant it on any tilled soil. Select the water skin, water your plants, refill your water skin when needed. After a few days, you'll harvest its produce. Initially, you'll get seeds from wild plants and harvest from plants in your fields. Thanks. So, seed bag, carrots. Um. 
Well, it's not much, but it's a start. That's what I think, Dad. Thanks for believing in me. Man, it's been a while since I played a farm Stardew-like, honestly. Ever just get no more stamina, eat something, or get rest. Oh, dear. Well, time to meet people, I guess. Your adoptive grandmother and the person who keeps track of the weather. Oh. I offered a flower like this one for my rite of passage so long ago. Oh, thanks. Tomorrow's going to be special. I can feel it. Also, stop calling your grandfather daddy. He's grandpa. Oh, okay. Sorry. I must have bumped my head in the night. I had a pretty crazy cheese dream. You know her as the partner of the clan's leader who puts together all the festivals. Ah. There's so much to do. We'll need lots of contributions if we're going to prosper in this new land. If you could contribute three different items, that would help a lot. Patchens are known to work together. As a member of this Patchen clan, you're expected to contribute to its prosperity. You can drop what you'd like to contribute every day in the contribution box. Contributions can be used to exchange with your clan. It's the way each member appreciates the work the other has done. Prosperity is the sum of your and the rest of the clan's contributions. It is not spent nor exchanged. It can only go up. As the clan prospers, they'll be able to develop ideas and change how they live in meaningful ways. That sounds like bloody communism to me. Oh, we're a bunch of socialists around here. Hey, 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 hey. Morph just brings capitalism to prehistoric times. Happily, imagine that. Sharing and caring and not working every hour of every day. Just to be able to feed yourself. Uh, the caretaker of the clan's kids, she loves teaching them about the world. She's got a partner. Keeping track of everyone that's single. <laughs> There's got to be some single people around here, surely. I don't see why Grob can't take a break from clearing that wood. I'm sure Vvak... Vvak... <laughs> I know you've always read it as a double V, but his name is Vvak. Like, Gwak could use his help. A clothing maker who helps his mum, Jizz, dress the clan. I have to figure out what I'm going to wear to that ceremony. Probably this. Sister of the clan's musician. I don't want to copy Jelrod's offering, but nothing else fits. Wait, can I see your info again? Dance. Do you want to dance? Oh, okay. I mean, I thought we were just a happy go lucky clan here, but alright. Mm -mm -mm. Ah, so this is her brother. For my rite of passage, I offered my first instrument. It was hard to choose with my many talents. The leader's daughter wants to be next in line. I'm all for hard work, but Nock already made a dish. I don't know why he's still inside cooking. And I know. Can I dance on my own? Find three different items to give. seed. No. Gotta find some. This is so chill so far. I love how colourful it is. Gorgeous. Who are you? Ada, the clan's healer. I'll just have this voice too, it's just the only old lady voice. Honestly, I got a bit excited. You <laughs> seeing it first, I didn't realize you're an old lady. I thought you were just a, a gorgeous gal with white hair, but uh, you know, from this distance, my wrinkles really don't come through. Uh, Igorg told me about his plan for the fields. I gathered some from these plants. Tomato. 
Have fun in the fields. You say tomato. I say tomato. The one who keeps predators away. The mother of wolves. The wolves can pick up on everyone's excitement. I bet they'd love it if you gave them a treat. The clan's artist. Loves kids even though she doesn't have any of her own. Ron loves playing bones, even though Teddy crushes him every time. You should go try too. I heard Teddy's giving a stone box to anyone who can beat her challenge. It's really hard to tell people's age from <laughs> up here. I thought this was literally like a three-year-old painting on a rock. Give the dogs a treat. seem to trust us enough. Oh, okay. Acre, the clan's toolmaker. Tired of making paths. You might want to craft some for the fields. Open your inventory. Once there, craft in empty slots or in dedicated crafting slot. Choose the item you want to craft and fulfill required items. Instructions for crafting more items will become available as your clan prospers. Open your inventory, click on an empty slot, okay. Oh, uh, no, I would still like the tutorials, thank you. Um, open inventory, click an empty slot to craft. So at the moment I can make floors, okay. The clan's builder. The kids are all concerned about the right of passage. I'm just concerned they do their chores. Can I go in your home? What a lovely home you have. Play the drum. Look at all this space. It's like a TARDIS. It's so big on the inside. Oh, I'll just be taking these tomatoes. Hey, what's yours is mine, right, guys? Ron. <laughs> One who collected water for the clan. There isn't much for him to do here between two rivers. I don't want to call Teddy a cheater, but that old woman moves too fast for her age. Teddy, the clan's storyteller. Want to try your hand at bones? Um, I thought you were my grandma, actually. I'm just now realizing that the person telling the story wasn't also my grandma who spoke to me in the morning. Yes, we're just all the same, us old ladies with the white hair, and we all sound like this, darling. Toss the rock and pick up the bones before it falls. A mini game. Throw stone. Alright. So this is like their fishing, huh? stuff, haven't I? Hmm. I need to eat something. thought I had some tomatoes. Didn't I pick some tomatoes? In my pocket. Eat this. It's right there. Wait, people move around as well. Like, she's here now. dance, Grandma? Wow, even my own Grandma doesn't love me enough to dance with me. It's hard to believe Jack had his rite of passage over two springs ago. Where does the time go? It 
Let's see if we can find some food anywhere. Saved your life. The Thinker. Igrok asked me to help find seeds for the fields. To think these tiny, almost rocks will grow into plants. Thanks. I wonder what else we can find once we're unstuck. is very cute so far. Let me know in a comment if you would like to see more of this game, you know. We'll see how far I get with this video. And then, you know, go from there. <gasps> Citronella. Can I eat it? Hi, doggy. I mean, just imagine living in nature, fresh food, animals around, what more do you need? Dancing, playing music, singing with each other, telling stories. And that's how it's going to be on Bear Island. Join my cult, hit subscribe. And when the end times come get a special message for the meeting place and we'll all meet there and we'll build this society and when I say we I mean you because I don't know how to build anything so you know if you're a builder definitely come along like you know you needed uh, eh. when I get nervous I fish but I don't need this many thanks if you're nervous you can try fishing too Stand in the water and use your hand axe. Hover your cursor over a fish to activate the minigame. In case you're likely good at catching it, try your luck any time. Wait till the bar is full. If the fish sees you, hover outside. Wait, what? Hover over the fish. Likelihood if it sees you, hover outside the circle. Alright, let's get fishing a go. that fish. Oh, I can dot. Probably need to cook it, huh? I guess five stamina is not very much. I just ate raw fish. I mean, what, you guys, you just discovered sushi, dude. You're gonna be rich. Congratulations. How do I rest, I wonder? Maybe I can just lay down in bed. Get to sleep for the day? No. The fields are looking great already. Don't forget to give them love every day. People are sort of gathering around the fire. This might be the best opportunity for me to try and speak to everyone. As night falls, looks like everyone's coming down here. I don't see why I can't have my right of passage with you. I do a lot of work around her. How cool is it your right of passage is the biggest patcha tree I've ever seen? Wait for my for the rite of passage. I bet Ter's gonna make sweets. He's playing music. It's like he he's actually playing it along with the soundtrack. That's so cool. Um, who haven't we spoken to yet? since I fished with Freya. It's pretty fun. I don't think we've met, have we? Jag. He watches the fire. <laughs> Fawak doesn't need my help. I've been trying to get those rocks cleared. Now, what's your job around here? I watch the fire. Oh. 
hard work is in the way. I guess I should uh, contribute some stuff to the box, right? One. Two. Three. There you go. Three things in the box. Three unique contributions. Do I have the energy to dance? How did I bring that up before I was about to dance with myself, no? I swear I triggered it somehow whilst we were trying to fish. And everyone's going back to bed. I guess I will as well. Catch you later, guys. Enjoy the fire. I'll invent some marshmallows soon. What are you doing? Sorry, I was just watching you sleep, Grandpa. You look so peaceful. Go to bed! Sorry. I contributed. Your rite of passage. The clan has travelled far for this day. When I first asked Patch about this day, she called us to leave our old home. We travelled far, but she rewarded us with this safe and fruitful land. She has given us much. Today we honour her with a promise. It's when our totems are ready to reveal themselves that we're asked to serve the land, the spirits in our clan. Yo, mine better be a bear. Silence. You will get what you are given. Oh, sorry. I didn't realize you could hear me. I am the shaman. I hear everything. Let us begin the sorting ceremony. Hufflepuff. Ibon, Frere, and Nock, how will you seal this promise? Oh, I was meant to keep something to put in here, wasn't I? <laughs> With Patch's rocks, I've discovered the magic of sound. Today I offer my first instrument. Yvonne, we've heard the roar of your music. The cave lion is the spirit that protects you. I don't have anything. In Patch's waters, I've learned to watch the movements of fish. Today, I offer the cat she gave me this morning. Freya, you've shown your patience on the riverbanks. The animal that protects you is the bear. No fair. taught me the art of combining different ingredients to make something mouth-watering. Today I want to offer my best dish. Knock, I only know one creature that shares your passion for food. A morph. The wild boar protects you. Why did they all get to do it together and I have to be here on my own? Morphe, how will you seal your promise? <gasps> Seeds that grow quickly into food that we can harvest. A fish that I was lucky enough to catch. A flower that blooms like friendship. A dish that gives us stamina for our day, day, day. I guess I'm choosing what perk I want. If I choose a fish, will I also get the bear? have luck. 
I mean, I'm guessing a flower that blooms like friendship, maybe you get a bonus to making friends with people. Seeds that grow quickly. Faster growing seeds, like that could be pretty useful. More stamina. I, I guess I'll go with the fish because I, I, I want to get the bear. Vibrate to the same tune as Punch's Waters. Improved luck catching better fish. For generations, we've been guided by the spirits of animals. But long ago, when Pacha first plucked humanity from the stars, it was her ancient spirit who advised us. Same spirit protects you now. Ah, so I got the big dog, huh? The tree of Pacha. So I could have picked anything. Damn. Whatever Pacha's plans are, you should know we are here with you. Hey. This is like our first festival. I guess now this is exactly what I wanted and I can talk to anyone that I didn't meet yet. Normally I don't like to give extra meaning to things, but a patch of tree totem seems pretty important. My rite of passage was a bit different. Your energy seems different now. Hypothetically, which would make a better leader, a boar or a horse? A horse? Exactly. A leader needs to move fast and look out for the group. I just thought it was majestic. Thanks for contributing. I have something to give you after the feast. I guess there was something special about today. An ancient spirit is a very powerful totem. I think I have a lot to meditate on. Uh, Ebon looks so cool up there, you did too, I guess. Even though Bear protects my grandson, he still needs to make sure he puts on enough layers. Chosen by Patra herself, what an honor. Do, 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 do. I don't know why Ebon was so nervous, she did great. Ebon copied my rite of passage offering too. When will that girl stop trying to be me? My little girl is an adult now. I have some dust in my eye. I thought my totem was cool. And I heard yours. You must be so excited. Don't you just love to dance? I do. Let's dance together. Oh, I'm not allowed. Okay. You looked amazing up there. Well, thank you. Have I spoke to everyone? It says, talk to Ted. Thank you for contributing to the clan. I think I did talk to everyone. The mission's no longer here. I wish Chelrod would stop staring at me. I wasn't copying him. Exactly. Wait, who do I need to talk to? said she has something for me after, right? You always make me so proud. Thanks, Grandpa. Not sure I like that Patcha has more plans for our clan. Congratulations, the Tree of Patcha Totem. How exciting. Where do I go? Where's the person I need to talk to? you, but you don't care. <laughs> Go back, sure. Cute little party, isn't it? Since we found you long ago and ended up traveling to this land. 
Hi, little creature. Settling the land is inspiring the clan to have ideas. Ideas require the clan to reach a certain prosperity. Approaching the animals in the forest. Oka has an idea how to approach the animals. Talk to her. Are we just chilling in the forest? Oh, it's like a family day out. Grob tries to tell Grandma I should learn to hunt, but who'd fish? It's nice to finally see the green again. Sure is. Any fish here? Patience is key. It was three bars. Ba bam. Michael Serafish. say catch now. And another one. It's a cute different way of doing it. I mean, so many fishing mini games are all the same, aren't they? Change it up a little bit. Alright, that'll do, pig. Ah, your ochre. Okay, let me find you. Okay, I should collect these while I'm here. I want to be a good farmer. Grow a big crop, you know? Can I pick this mushroom? Mario! Let's, um... Find the wolf guy. Oh, you're not here. Okay. I think we're just hanging out in the forest with everyone. Life shouldn't be taken too seriously. I agree. Ah, oh, wait, here. Good to see you contributing so much. I hope you keep it up. Had an extra solar dryer. I hope you find it useful. A solar dryer sounds so um, high-tech, but it's literally just a dryer. It uses the sun. Pacha gave us good hunting grounds. I have new meat every Wednesday if you need some of my meat. Th thanks, Grub. I guess I'll have a little wander and see if there's anything else to collect here. Different mushrooms here that look pickable. Brown mushroom, okay. Everything is new to us as we explore. I don't know if I can pick these flowers, doesn't seem so. More mushrooms. A uh, little bunny, little bunny rabbit. stuff later on. I saw that in the trailer. Okay, it doesn't seem to be too much else here. Does that mean camp? Ah, okay. I don't know why I kind of just thought it was going to like fast travel me back, but it's actually be walk screen to another and then back again. Where's the wolf? There he is. Wolf boy, wolf boy. Contributions while I'm here. I only wanted to give one. Actually, do you know what? You can just have them. It's fine. You saw those beautiful animals too. They don't seem afraid, but don't pay, much us, pay us much attention either. I heard them react to some bird songs. I asked Ibon to sing when nearby. Her beautiful voice doesn't seem to work. 
vaguely remember a story about animals that liked music, though. Give him plant fiber one day. Remember a story that'll help us get closer to animals. Nice. I like that. I should, uh... Water my crops, actually. Because I didn't get to yesterday. We were too tired. Put me dryer down. Plant some more carrots. Some beans. Four beans. We do watering first so that we don't run out again. Sploomp, sploomp, sploomp. <laughs> I like the way we squeeze it out. Oh no, nearly empty. <gasps> That's a nice sound. We managed to build a village in the winter. Still a lot we need to do. some yoga. I like mailer and time, but there's something nice about sharing a home with so many people. We need all hands contributing if we're to prosper here. New idea, not to the river again. Boda. You. Oh, sorry, didn't mean to spray your back with water there. Taking trips to the river to refill our water skins gets tiring. While taking a nap, I heard the sound of water underground. I wonder if there's a way to reach it. Oh, if I get you some stones, you'll think about how to make a well. Make it those whilst you're near. you down. Boulder, where did you go? Where did she run to? I want you to get to thinking. That's not you, is it? No. What would you like to do with your time if you lived in this sort of society? Or what would you be doing on our Cult starts. Mm -mm. Research your idea, darling. There we go. Now I can go back to the farm. Squeeze, squeeze, squeeze. Okay. Four beans. Put them here. Another carrot. Mm -mm -mm -mm. How did I go through my stamina so quickly yesterday? Must have been the rocks that I hit, right? my mission. Find wild seeds and plant them. So four crops to be harvested but I mean that's going to be a few days, isn't it? For them to grow. Da, da, da. So we've done some contributions. I guess I'll clear the land a bit more. I used to always like starting a new game of Harvest Moon. Clearing the farm was so satisfying to me. The SNES version. The Super Nintendo. Oh, 
I wonder if we make more tools or if this is just like an omni tool that we're going to continue to use for everything or whether it upgrades. It does it all. Maybe you would fish. Maybe you would be a storyteller. Maybe you'd be a dancer. Maybe you would watch the fire. Maybe you'd be a farmer. Maybe you'd be an old person. Sharing wisdom. <laughs> That's what I like to think about my live streams. Just an old person sharing wisdom, you know? Listen here, you, in my day. Oh man, we have the single blockbuster. It's crazy. Definitely going to be trying to romance people in this. Prosperity. The fish seems to do pretty good. Probably do quite a bit of fishing as well. It's always good to do in these games. Oh, Frere's totem is a lot to bear. Man, I'm an early riser, aren't I? Up for the oldies. Good morning to the world, going down to the river. It's really not worth building a well, this is like right here, isn't it? I mean, maybe it's a long walk for you guys, but not for me. Keep your research. We can explore this land. Hopefully we'll find ore, maybe some good flint. Wolf boy, what have you learned? I was right. Teddy told me the story again. Our ancestors imitated birds to get close to their prey. With the right whistles, the animals wouldn't run. This made me think of our flutes, the ones we use for rituals and dances. Some of them sound like birds, too. I asked Aker to make this special flute. I'm sure it'll work. Oh, I get to play a flute? Try it. Make some new friends. Approach a wild animal to interact with it. Once a day, attune with the animal playing the mini-game until the notes are filled. Once fully attuned, more actions will be available, such as talking, which will increase friendship with them. Eventually, you'll be able to invite wild animals to live in the fields. Play the flute in a radius by not targeting a specific animal. They react depending on their status. Wild animals will show you if they recognize you, and fully attuned animals will increase friendship. Let's go to the forest. Gonna play my flute to some animals. Making animal friends. I'll be the animal keeper. The Doctor Doolittle of the tribe. Fill my water while I'm here. Got a little flute. Oh, what's she doing out here? Does seem to be something special about this land. Sure does. Where are all the animals that were here? There were so many. Oh, a little bunny rabbit. I'm gonna be friends with the bunny rabbit. Click. This is very cute. Oh, it's a nice song, too. Very, very cute. I 
feel like I've been a Wes Anderson film. So we can also do it just in an area. They're like, what is that? But how will I know to, how to play to the same rabbit? Oh my god, look at the size of you. Animals have different songs. Different ones for different animals. Okay, I guess I'll do both big boars that could be here and take you with us somehow. play music four times a day. Man. Potatoes. What's your favorite way to have potato? I had a jacket potato this weekend. Love a jacket potato. I had it with tuna. But um, I feel like my favorite jacket potato is beans and cheese. Baked beans and cheese jacket potato. Delicious. Comfort food. Rose hips. Mm, 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 mm. If your name was Rose, I feel like it would be. You'd have to get like a little tattoo of roses on your hips and be like, it's me rose hips. I'm Rose and it's me rose hips. Is that too basic? That's too obvious. This is why I don't have any tattoos. My ideas are terrible. What's in here? Power is out of reach. Cave. I feel like I'm back in Iceland. Mm -hmm. A shortcut to the village, sure. I'll catch a couple of fish to uh, give us tribute today. I ah, gotcha. A pork pine. I think the village is this way. Yeah, forest that way. So here's the village. Let's see, where's that kid that I need to talk to? Is that them there? Mm -mm -mm. Oh good, it has the little exclamation marks. I would never actually recognize them from their tiny picture. Smelling the flowers, darling. Uh. A bear totem. I love fishing, but I'm not sure I'm ready for the clan to depend on just me. Can you help me by catching and contributing three fish? Oh, Sh sure. I was going to catch fish anyway, was I? deep enough for the water to flow into and some rocks to contain it. I call it a well. I made you one with the materials you brought me. Oh, 
Nice. I guess I'll, uh, I have my own well now. Look at that. Outside. Oh, so it has to be here, huh? Boink. Cool. Let's catch some fish. What do you say? We must contribute. I said I could try and catch them at any time, right? But... Unless I wait until it says catch now, it doesn't seem to. First one we've had, be scared. A new record fish. Need one more for the mission. Looking at their tick tock. <laughs> it's all they pay attention to now is that bloody tick tock. TikTok.com slash at madmorph for gaming recommendations. Let's throw these in here then. That's three fish. The caves are calling, and energy seems to be flowing in the caves. seeing that. New smoke signals. I love that that means missions. The forest caves are emitting a powerful energy. Freya has a gift for you to thank you for your help. Oh, it's raining. Ah, no watering the crops for me today. Okay. gift for me down here. I want it. Are you guys still all asleep in here? It's so nice to have another fisher in the clan. I made this smoker for you. It helps the fish keep longer. Thanks, bud. And it works for meats. And I got the crafting instructions. Cool. Trust, you know, if only we had a place for animals in our clan. No idea. We got close to the animals. Invite, inspect. Kroll has an idea. Talk to him first. Hmm. Eh. There's a trailer. That's okay. Just do what was practiced. I don't remember my lines. I got this. Good. Just don't be overly dramatic about it. 
I would never. <sighs> the caves are a maze of challenges built by the totems to test you. It won't be easy, but you can do it. To pass these trials, you must first prove your strength. We're breaking rocks. Sorry. Good luck. Cute. Breaking rocks, you say? I am so strong. Look at me go. Smash. I'm a big, strong boy. Why is he talking to himself like that? I don't know. Oh, it's the rocks in here, is it? Yeah. You didn't have to do those ones out there. Oh, right. Yeah, I knew that. Trailer, smash rocks. Uh -huh. What are these? Nothing. What's this? Let it drop on me head. No. Is it a stalactite or a stalagmite? Stalag wish up wish tonight. So this is like Stardew Mining. You may have proven your strength, but there's more you need to do to impress Owl. What? What do I need to do? Power is out of reach. Just lights or stuff I can pick up. Nothing. Matching the symbols on the statues to my paintings was Don's idea. I'm extra proud of the pine cone and the pomegranate. Clip just wants to make sure that stays a secret. Oh. Never mind. A pomegranate and a pine cone. They have to like get those somehow. As sure as a tree is steady, a relationship will produce greatness. Go ahead and try that line in the club. Hey girl. As sure as a tree is sturdy. What is this big thing? Honor this totem with what it desires, and you will be deemed worthy of its attention. So it wants a pomegranate and a pine cone, huh? Well. I shall return when I have those things, I suppose. Before asking for favors from the totems, you must first offer your friendship in form of gift, hence, a painted on rules. any ore or anything in here, just stone. Maybe a little further on. Do I have to walk back through all of them? 
Surely there should be a shortcut back. Maybe there is. Pine cone and pomegranate. I do like a bit of pomegranate flavour on stuff. It's used in things. It's uh, quite tasty. Let's see what kind of fish they have today. Distribution box here. One for four. Oh. I am the fishing lucky one. The lucky fishing one. Gonna catch a new record. Home again, home again, jiggity jig. can't talk to that person about the animal idea. Wait, everyone's huddling up inside here for some reason. Is it because it's raining? You all scared of a little bit of rain? I'm not! See how quick he was out the door when I said that. <laughs> Straight away. This land makes it so I can keep my medicine box pretty stocked. I know rain is good and all, but it makes the day so boring. How do I make friends with people? I guess give them stuff? It, it's a be cozy inside kind of day, every day. Who can I romance? How can I romance? Pets, ideas, the world. fish, I guess. Plus five stamina on him, but I'll get other stuff to smoke. I just want to keep giving to the tribe for now. Uh, who has the idea down here? Can't tell if it's night time or just miserable. Animals sure are fast. If only we could go as fast as them. We could reach places faster and carry things from further away. If I give you any root... And we might be able to ride on the backs of animals with 10,000 tribe prosperity as well. Okay, I don't know how to get root, but maybe when I harvest stuff I'll have roots. You say that you can understand wild animals now. They're friendly and would like to come to fertile land. I've seen animals take shelter in caves. Some of them build their own houses, like birds and trees. Okay, get some wood for you so we can make a pen for animal taming. And also, I figured out the dance button, right? E was dance. Wait, why is it not doing it now? There. Let me join in. Look at that. Give it, give it, give it, give it, give it. Dancing with my friends. No one wants to dance with me. Mm, 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 mm. Say, I'll dance with you, Morph, in a comment. Unlike these guys. A smoked fish. Uh, not much stamina left, but do I have any seeds to throw in here? Carrots. I don't really want to mix my uh, seeds up, so I'll wait. 
it's not the prettiest farm, but there's no reason not to be OCD about it. It is the fifth of spring. Out we go. Is this stuff ready yet? Is that ready to harvest? I'm scared to just hit it. I don't think so. This is harvest in right days. Be careful. More potatoes. There's more carrots as well, so we'll pop these right in here. Oops. Empty, but I have a handy well now, don't I? Good morning, grandson. Here to watch over you, like a foreman. Missed a bit. Yeah, I'm on it, granddad. I'm doing my best. You might have got the Tree of Pacha symbol, but doesn't mean you're too special to tend to the farm boy. What's on the agenda? Oh yeah, get some wood. Wait. Oh no, it says zero. I thought it said eight for some reason. Wood, 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 wood. How much wood, 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 chuck, chuck, wood, chuck, chuck, wood. She sells seashells by the seashore. Red leather, yellow leather, red leather, yellow leather, red leather, yellow leather. What's your favourite tongue twister? Pretty good at them. It's funny that I can barely talk normally sometimes, <laughs> and I pronounce many, many words wrong, but pretty good at tongue twisters. Red leather, yellow leather, red leather, yellow leather, red leather, yellow leather. That's a hard one. Try saying that ten times fast. I made my own one once. What was it? Trying to think now. It was during the game that I was playing and we had this conversation. The f the Fresh Prince made fresh French... <laughs> the, f the Fresh Prince made fresh French press coffee. Try saying that. The Fresh Prince made French... The Fre... The Fresh... The Fresh Prince made fresh French press coffee. The Fresh Prince made French press... It's hard. Even I can't do that one too well, and I made it up. I made that up whilst playing a horror game. Just the odd rambles that come up whilst streaming games. Years ago, and I still remember it. Because that was like a very long stream. It was probably like eight hours, nine hours in. I was clearly starting to lose my mind a little bit. I used to casually do like 12 hours plus. In my old, in my younger days. Not advisable. Not these days. Uh, oh, my stamina's nearly gone. Let's eat the fish. Munched. Happy. So I think I have enough wood, right, to go and talk to this guy? So now that it's now that I've had the conversation, but I didn't have enough things, I doesn't have a exclamation mark anymore. So I have to find you and click that again. Search that for me, okay? Build. I can ask you to build stuff. Small huts. Build my own home. Whoa, that's cool. Didn't know that was a thing. What about you? Can you do stuff? Tools! A flint axe and a flint hammer and a water bucket. Oh. What about you? 
Wanna dance? No, okay. I wanna dance with somebody. I wanna feel the help with somebody. What's that you're singing? Uh, nothing, sorry. What's happening here? Are you sure? The energy is too strong to deny. Is it good? The energy. I can't tell. But I know it's important we go to that side. Then we'll find out. They're building something. A bridge. The more I meditate, the more I think you need to join us when we cross the river. I don't know much about the spirits, but I trust Vwak. At least you're not traveling for a season this time. Maybe Patra wants us to over there to find new paints. The girl can dream, can't she? Alright. Wait, is this like what? This is, look at how much farmland there is. Oh my god. I thought this was my little farm. It's just more. So much more. That is so much land to, like, plant stuff on. That's crazy. Oh my gosh. My little farm's up there. Need to make sure we contribute today. Wait, isn't this a root? I needed three of these before, right? It looked just like that on the picture, but I guess not. I should be able to talk to that guy about the pens today, right? Oh, Kroll is still working on it. One more day to finish, okay. Wait for that then. My first harvest, look. Wild carrots are ready. Are these, are these ready? They are, beans, wild beans. Nice. Oh, and the beans keep growing, awesome. Some more seeds back in. Mm, 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 mm. Igrok has a new idea. I'm too old to be tending crops in the field, uh, but I think I can still help. What if I grew plants to harvest their seeds? I could even grow saplings for trees. Then you'll always have something to plant. That's very thoughtful of you. I'm going to think about what makes plants grow best. Don't laugh if you see me singing to them. Oh, if you want my body and you think I'm sexy. Mm, maybe try a different song. Okay. So we can dry stuff in here. put a carrot in there. Oh. Dry everything but vegetables. Time to water the crops. You're in the splash zone, little tomato plant. Potatoes, I think. Mm -hmm. I'm going to keep clearing, I think. You can now build your own house. I like living with the grandparents. It's fine. To say, whenever you're ready to move out, Kroll can build your house. That's funny because I discovered that like randomly myself, didn't I? Right, 
it's a rainy day, so the crops don't need watering. Kroll finished working on an idea. He's over on the bridge, so easy to find him. Let's head over there now and learn about building an animal pen. Then I can bring my boars here. The animals with like a basic structure similar to our homes. We'll call it Small Shed. It'll have a place to sleep, fresh water, so they won't have to go to the river. We brought enough materials to build one shed. <gasps> oh. Okay. Um. Can I just put it up here? It's so like. Or maybe in there? No, that's not quite letting me. I'll have it there. Perfect. Great. I'll start working on it soon. Tameable animals can be invited to live in your fields once they're fully attuned. You need to build an animal shed. They need to eat every day. Each morning they go outside to graze. Fill their troughs and make sure they have food to eat if they can't find grass outside. Animals that haven't fed the previous day will be hungry and not want to interact as much. A hungry animal can be hand-fed to alleviate their hunger for the day. Sheds need to be cleaned periodically. If left dirty, it'll increase the chances of an animal getting sick. No. I should be able to move my balls in now, then. Let's head over to the forest, since it's a rainy day, and invite them. Running through the village. Having myself a Drew Barrymore moment frolicking in the rain here. Do you like walking? Man, I got caught in some crazy hail recently. I like to take walks to a park that's near me that has a pond and stuff. Just kind of walk there and then sit for a bit. And chill out on the benches and then I come back. And uh, last time... A few times ago, I was leaving, and as I left, it started to spit, like some very light rain, and just slowly, 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 it just opened up more and more and more, until it was hail, just pelting me as I was walking home. Very heavy and hard, and like, so much that visibility was difficult, it was just like... Absolute hailstorm walking back in it. And I just like had to laugh to be honest. I just thought it was kind of funny in an experience. It was interesting. So these are my two attuned ones. Building. Oh, I have to wait for it to be built. I'm an idiot. Why did I think I could invite them already? <laughs> thought it was like instant place like the other things oh well I'll come back the great connector the clan finished the bridge to cross to the jungle I see you brought morph let's get going you tread into the jungle The air is dense with energy. It feels... heartbroken. Hmm. Hmm. Hey, that's what I said. Patch's voice. It's in these pictures. I should meditate on them. Achieved by working together. 
the earthquake. It must be the one that locked us in this land. Then Pacha gives you an ancient totem and we find this structure. It has to be related. She must be asking for our aid. Show what can be achieved together. I like that there's this ongoing story with it too. It's interesting. Oh, sorry. I'm a bit aggressive trying to talk to you. It's warm when you touch it. Have you tried? The weird structure or? Yes, the weird structure. Oh. Um. On with the wild prophecies. Huh. The plants they grew took a more resilient shape found the seeds and planted them over and over, deepening their knowledge and discovering new ways to care for them. So I have to do four things. This is basically the community center. <sighs> cool. Whatever Patcha needs, I hope we're up for the task. Through the jungle, walking through the jungle. What do you see? Dark in that jungle. I like that tree there, I'll leave it. This one can go though. I'll get a bunch more wood. What's just on my land readily available? Eight. Eight for a tree. Pretty cool. Plants thrive in this land, but why? I tasted the water. It's no different from other places we've been. The winds doesn't blow any weaker or stronger. But then I smelled the richness of the soil. I put some of it in the vases we used for storage and planted a seed. It grew just like the ones in our fields. Now all that's left to decide is where we want our plant nursery to be. Oh. Spot one. Spot two. Spot three. Ruined. Over there. Whoa, so many options. A plant nursery. Do I want that so close to home? How important is it going to be, I wonder? There seems like a good spot. Got a good feeling about that. There you go. I am categorizing all the seeds we've accumulated so far. When crawl's done, you can browse the seeds I have. Another day, another patch of dollar. Are these? Nope, those are not ready to be harvested. <laughs> Stop. Makes me very nervous that he does that. Oh, there we go, harvest. Oh, I think it says in the bottom right, harvest, if it's ready to harvest, so I should look out for that. But also it should be a different button because I don't want to accidentally remove a crop, you know? Do I have any more seeds to put in? I don't. Now, what was I working on? Because this is not only another day in game, it's another day in my mind. Um, Kroll has finished building the small animal shed. There it is. Yeah, look at this. Okay, I wonder how many animals we can get in here. Or if I have to only have one type, let's find out. Let's go straight to the forest and invite those boars to come live with us. <laughs> By which I mean a boar the animal, not a very boring creature. Uh -oh. 
and yeah, this game is very joyful. I like looking at it, I like hearing it. When it started up and I was sort of getting ready to record, sat here with my herbal tea and um, just the menu music, I was just absolutely bopping out to it. It's so feel good. Hiccup, sorry. <laughs> Man, I feel like, you know, as much as I am one of these people that is constantly working, I'm a workaholic, I feel like somewhere inside me there's just a cottagecore girly waiting to, you know, spread her wings. I would love to just live somewhere with no social media, no nothing, and just raise animals and drink tea and coffee. You know, I don't know if I truly have it in me as a way of life, but, um, you know, <laughs> I say this as someone, have a little dance, I say this as someone that is, you know, on social media and going, sharing stuff on social media, it's kind of like my job now, sharing games on there, right, and making games here, and, oh man, it's be nice to just disconnect from it all someday, won't it? Let's see... How about you? How, on a scale of 1 to 10, how cottagecore girly are you? What would you, uh... Ah, it's those two over there. Okay. 10 being, I'm ready to drop everything morph and, uh... Go and live in this cult of yours and do absolutely nothing but lay in fields looking at stars and drinking tea. Sounds amazing. And petting cats. My dream is to have a cat island. I've talked about this in other videos, but that is the dream, is to just one day have a island of cats, and that's it. That's my life. Move wild boar to the shed. Wild boar has moved in with clan. How about you? Two boar. Maybe they'll have baby boars. Were they a boy and a girl? I don't know. And then... What if I try and get one of these deer or something? Mm -mm. Sorry, it's walking my character into trees here whilst I'm drinking. <laughs> Bought a bunch of herbal tea recently to try and stop having coffee so late. Oh, he's doing a little, you're singing. Are you like friendly? Ah, so the ones that are going duh, 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 like I've played to them before, so maybe I can get a little white rabbit. Alice, Alice, Alice. Curiouser and curiouser with a white rabbit. Playing my flute for the white rabbit. Yeah. Who's gonna love in a top hat? And. Is not a cat. Bunny trusts you now. If you had your own place, you can invite it to live with you. Oh. So you're a pet. Oh, look at the petting. Look, I'm saying petting. Aren't you proud of me? In recent videos, I've used the word stroke. Many Americans have had taken an issue with me for saying stroking, stroking this animal, stroking this thing. They say, it's petting. It's petting, Morph. We say stroke, stroke the bunny. But, um, wait, so can you be my pet? Mary's allergic to animals. Ah, so once I get my own house, I can have a pet bunny rabbit, but you can't live in the barn with the boars. Okay. I guess I'll go find those deer and play my flute to them. Hmm. I hope you're enjoying this video. Let me know in a comment. I really wanted to get it out before now. Whenever this does come out... Excuse me. I was hoping that it would be days before, but... I kind of got really into it, and I wanted to make it a longer video than what I was going to do. And show off even more of the game, actually. I was just going to do an hour or two, but... I've sort of been playing it a lot more. I don't know how long it'll actually end up being 
in the edit, but we'll see. I feel like I could get into this, you know? Where are they? Where my I don't... Didn't mean to do that. My dear, where are you? A doe, a deer. Doe eyes, siren eyes. Mm -hmm. Can't wait to get a mount. Stupid legs having to run everywhere. Do, 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 do. Can I like shake this tree? Yeah. Pomegranate. That's what I need for the cave. Oh my god, so cute. Look at it sleeping. <sighs> ah, that was so cute. It made my like feet curl up. Can I get this too? Hang on. No. What about pine cones? <gasps> Inventory full. But wait, wasn't pine cones the other thing that I needed? Wasn't it a pomegranate and a pine cone? Um, maybe like eat the mushrooms? Can I do that? Why you go ick? Mushroom bad? Maybe just drop it just to be safe. So wait, let me go in and um give this in. I'm pretty sure it was a pine cone and a pomegranate. If I get all the way in there and it's not bummer, you know? Um let's get some more just to be safe. Pomegranate. I didn't know pomegranate grew up trees. Is it growing a big tree like that? Learning. Clearly I won't be the gardener of the cat island. I joke about the cult, but would it be too weird if like I actually one day did buy a cat island if I like took applications for people to live there? Is that too culty? Is that is that like is that like it's becoming real? Is that too far? <laughs> right, I require a five hundred word essay on why you would be suited to life on the island. Like some sort of character from Lost. Will you play along with my fantasy that the island is magical? So let's see. I'm pretty sure that's a pine cone and a thing, but does it want it here or I think it wants it in the back room, doesn't it? Honor this totem. Sure. Honor. How do I honor you with the pine cone? The totem accepts the offering. Are you ready? Sure. This trial tests your observation. Oh no, I've failed. I'm gonna fail already, aren't I? I tried to keep count. This is literally my weakness. Observing. Keeping count. All right, play along with me. One, two, three, four. Five, six, seven, eight. Are they different colors or were some of them the same? Was I meant to just count how many I saw? I just know Patch of a Loveless Challenge. Yes, yes, but it's not over yet. How many of us did you see? Oh, it was the ones that were different colored. Uh, eight isn't even an option, you idiot. Six. That's not right. Do you want to see it again? Yep. Yeah. Do it again. Just don't tell the other spirits. That's adorable. Thank you. Also, in a comment, wow, Morph got those challenges right first time every time. That's my YouTuber. All right, yellow, green, pink, orange. Da, 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 da. There's yellow again, and the blue. That's five. Green and pink. We already had you. That's five. 
If you make things a song, it helps. Ha, ha, ha. Five. First time. We'll build adult totems in no time. Are your babies? You're not supposed to tell the trailer that. We should just admit it. This is a trailer. A totem has their own rite of passage. And this is ours. If we're able to help you through these trials, we can show the others we're ready to serve Patcha too. But don't think we'll go easy on you. We're being tested too. Good luck, Trella. I almost forgot. Whenever you see the symbol, we can lend you our power to travel quickly. More challenges await through the door just opened. I see. So that's what those do. So what's, uh, what's the pomegranate for? For the next one? Maybe? I should put my flute away. <laughs> Hashtag no context. A flintstone. Meet the flintstones. How old were you when you realized that the flintstones were flint? Stones, as in flint and stone. I literally just thought their name was Flintstones. Didn't even get it. All right, so we're gonna have to chuck something so we can um, have pick some of this stuff up. I'm gonna just eat the carrot. I think. Can I eat the carrot? No. All right, I'll drop the carrot. So that way we can get a little bit of iron. Probably gonna be, uh, you know, important or something. I don't know if there is combat in these mines. Honestly, wouldn't mind it just being a chill experience. Sometimes the Stardew mine is a little bit stressful. This game feels so incredibly chill so far. I feel like combat in the mine would almost be out of place. It feels so incredibly peaceful. But, uh, we'll see. So do I still have to hit a bunch to open this next room? Don't know if it's how many I hit or hitting a certain rock, but... But yeah, loving this so far, honestly. Let me through. Into the next room. There we go. Again, singing helps. Shout out to that one person that commented like, I love your playthroughs, but please stop singing. Like, no, dude. <laughs> My life is a musical, okay? With flint, acre can make you better tools, I see. Hang on. Music was getting a little loud there. Okay, got another thing. Don and Toe have been avoiding me. There's something special going on. Fish. Blue fish, purple fish. See if we can get it open. So is it like pomegranate or pine cone? And actually it doesn't matter. Oh. Sorry, I don't know that. Shh, shh, Alexa, shush, what do you mean you don't know that? I said oop. What are you, shush. <laughs> I don't know if you heard that, but... Calm down, girl. The torch you got comes in handy for dark rooms like this one. A torch. I have a torch. 
Yes. There's a special torch to my right. If you light it, we'll be able to see. Ah. Thanks, Trevor. I'm afraid of the dark, even though I glow. You're adorable. Sweet little babe. Um, well, I guess I can... Getting low on stamina, but I mean, let's we'll come this far. Let's see if we can get through to the next room to see what we need. It's going to be some kind of fish, isn't it? Fish, two fish, red fish, blue fish. Another room. That probably wants me to have a better tool. A mighty axe to cut the tree. Oh, oh my god, is that a carrot? And a potato? The one, <laughs> the thing that I dropped. We're rooting for you. Roots. But where do you want them? Where did the fish one need to go? We'll skip back now. We've got no stamina. Back to the forest, darling. Whoa! Turned into bloody Sonic the Hedgehog. Uh-oh, it's night time. Let me take out my torch. Let me take out my torch, the new country album. Let me take out my torch. Oh, what's this? A nest. Shortcut home, yes. There you go, sorry. I had to cut the song short because uh, on the way home, but I was about to be an absolute banger. What rhymes with torch? Let me take out my torch. Sitting here on your porch. <laughs> Can just have all kinds of imagery, doesn't it? Ah, I keep forgetting about contributions. Getting so distracted with all the new shinies. Animals keep us warm for life. Some of our animals have fur. You can get a razor. Shear them. Okay. Kroll's finished building. Oka wants to develop riding animals. Yes, okay. We harvesting yet? <clears throat> I think I need a chest, right? I'm getting a little bit full. Go to my inventory real quick and drop the wild beans and then craft a box. Stone box. Stone fence. Craft a box. There we go. We'll start keeping all of our produce in there if we need to. I'm actually going to go and give these to... Uh, Tribute. Having said that, I keep forgetting. Trying to advance the old Triberuni there. Keep one potato since it seemed a pomegranate. We'll get rid of the pine cones now. Where's my wolf boy at? Up by the fire. Hey, Wolfie! 
Jizzle and I like to go over to Ron and Reese's when it rains. It's fun to go a little wild. Okay. Ah. I need to give you two roots. I... Wait. Is in root vegetables? Is it too late to take stuff out of here? Potatoes are roots, right? Uh, Mom, I saw a morphine taken out of the tribute box. Shh. To ride an animal, we'll have to gain their trust to make them feel comfortable. I'll see what I can do. Nice. Okay. We're working on riding animals. And speak to you. That's you there. Oh, sorry. Didn't mean to attack. I don't really like it when people interrupt my focus. Oh. That was just for the shears, was it? So I want a bunch of flint, really, to uh, make those tools. I'll take this for now. Interesting tool. A few precise hits with my hammer here and there. A bit of chiseling. Yes. Are you still here? Wait. Did you give me it? I'm not done. Come back in one day. Oh, okay. Interesting. I guess that's part of prehistoric life, waiting a day for things. I could never... I literally order groceries and it's here in two hours. Don't you know how we be living these days, darling? Hi, piggy. Base quality, base production, well-fed raspberry boar. I can rename you. Oh, I mean, it's got to be Pumba, isn't it? For a boar. Healthy, well-fed, okay. And then are you also... Oh, you're the same sex. Okay. So we're not going to have babies, are we? Okay. Pumba and um, Pedro. There we go. Pretty sure you're the same. Yep. Same symbol. I don't actually know what the symbols are, to be honest. I guess they just eat this grass, right? Are you going to eat my crops too? Am I supposed to, like, build a fence and fence you in? Guess we'll see what happens. Is they okay with me if you want to have a little munch? I guess one of the advantages of just growing this stuff for tribute is that I'm not min-maxing Stardew capitalist life here. It's kind of like if you want to have a snack, have a snack, you know, just don't eat the whole crop. Listen here, pig. We're uh, socialists here. If you want some beans, have some beans, okay? I'll shear you for it later. Let's water these. Oh! Those are ready to pick. That scared me. Carrot knowledge. I went to university for carrots. some seeds. Potatoes in the ground. Alright. So then... We're waiting on a razor. He's working on his idea for two years. And Carl's finished the plant nursery now. Okay. Let's go see where that is. Pretty sure I put that down there somewhere, didn't I? Oh wait, is that it there? The big tomato? Let's see. Or does that just mean this tomato field? <laughs> Why did I nearly call them potatoes? What's wrong with me? Okay, it is that, I think. Um... I'm guessing it's this guy over here. It's Grandad. There we go. Look. Hi, doggy. Scatter. 
Being the oldest in the clan has its advantages. No one can remember when I was an awkward teenager. Oh. Bew seeds. So we buy seeds with contribution that has been given to the tribe, I see. 20 for one. But almost like, <clears throat> why would I? Because it's like there's seeds everywhere that I can pull out of the ground. I get that you, you're getting them with contribution, but... Wait, was it the seeds I bought, or was it food? It was seeds, yeah. Another potato in there, nice and symmetrical. Carrot. Ah, oh, look at my knowledge. Now I know that it's going to be ready tomorrow and in four days and stuff because of my carrot knowledge. Okay, another row of tomatoes here. For my balls to munch on. Stick another bean. Right there, perfect. Water the bean. First we sow the bean. Then we water the bean. So we can grow the bean. Oh. <clears throat> potato. Oh, those are potatoes, and that's a carrot. Okay. Tribute box. Make up for what we took earlier. Throw my carrots in. Probably go back down the mine actually. Get some more flint so I can get those tools going. Let me skip ahead. I just ex accidentally ate a pine cone. happening oh it's like trying ah it like opened up behind there so I need a flint axe I think to now chop this okay and then we'll be able to get through and then I would assume that's gonna be where we put in the roots so I'll try and come back with some potatoes and that axe let's go back and See if we can't get her making a flint axe. The power of time. Kuro, the sun god, wants to lend us his power. Talk to Mary to learn more. Is Mary my grandma? Acres finished the blade shears. One day more on mounts. Is this Mary? Uh, grandma, wake up! Wake up! <laughs> I've been thinking about Kuro. He always rises from the mountains and goes to sleep on the other side. We can honor him by tracking the shadow every day. I know there's a power hidden in doing that. A sundial. I'll observe and let his rays warm my cheeks. Grandma, filth. Okay, we need to water our crops for the day. Go and pick up our shears and uh, get her making the other tools. Wait a day, get the axe, but it scares me when I pick up a carrot, I don't realize it's done. Okay, okay. 
And I'll hold on to the carrots now, because it looks like I'm going to need three roots for that next Romane. What do I have here? Not done yet. Okay. Water your seed. Let's check our animals. Hello, boys. You good? Healthy, well fed. A raspberry ball. Oh. Poop. Worst part of having a pet, to be honest with you. Can I fertilize with this? Oh. Can I smoke it? Girl, want a gift? Want a gift? This is awful. Next time, give it to Gelrod. Sorry, I actually thought you were the child. You look like a child. I was playing a prank. I'm sorry. I thought you'd find it funny. Here's your new tool. Nice. I don't have anything I can shear yet. I don't think I can shear a boar, but... <sighs> My nose bothers me this time of year. All the flowers. Acre, me and you, me and you, me and you both, darling. Tell me about it. All right, flint axe, please. Can I order another thing? Okay, no, I have to wait a day each time. All right. Gives me time to get some carrots and stuff, I guess. Do I have seeds to plant? One carrot seed. Bah, 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 bah. Pop that in here. And water it. And do a little magic. Uh... Wait, why's that got a thing? Hang on. What? How did I... That was like a... What does the upgrade symbol mean? Looks like I can upgrade it. I don't know how. Fish catching plus 12. What does it mean it's empty? Maybe it just means it's empty? No, it's definitely got a little up symbol. I don't know what to do with that. Probably talk to someone. Let's catch some fish. As is my rite of passage. I wonder if there's something to them coming out of the different symboled holes. That was a long one. A tic tac. Like the different purple, blue, blue, green. feeling about this one right here. It's going to be an extra sp special fish. A record catch. I can feel it. Okay. Here's a seashell to make up for earlier. Rob said my dad must be drawn to wood because he manages to step on every stick if he goes hunting. You've already gifted today. Okay. 
Look at the kids training, so cute. You tread into the jungle. Walking through the jungle, walking through the jungle, what do I see? Oh yeah, I forgot about this. Our community center, and is there no resources in here? It's literally just for visiting for your quest lines, it seems. How mystical. What a cooler way than just having a community center, honestly. Go across the bridge. I... I too flute. doing? Where is that? Oh, hello. We heard all the hammering and wondered what was happening. I'm Reese. Who might you be? Crack. This is my dad, Brub, and my mum, Inza. The leader of the Aquans. Oh, new people. You have to meet everyone. Maybe share a drink, too. You wish to share with us? All right. Do older women sound like this in your village, too? You betcha. I don't want to be argumentative, but for the hundredth time, we aren't Mog Mograni. At the huge fire. Men are patching before, dear. They follow the trees. We do. We haven't met any Mograni. And you don't want to. Oh no, bad people in my wholesome cozy game? Fangs. They have fangs. Oh dear. That seems a little ridiculous. <clears throat> a child from our clan was almost thrown into a fire by one of them. That's awful. It is. They have an unnatural obsession with fire. We think their presence is causing an imbalance that threatens our survival. You've given us much to think about. I hope our clans can be friends. Of course. You're always welcome to visit. I'd like that. We have some lovely fishing around here. What if they're secretly the Mograni and then we're like having dinner with them and they're like, fangs come out. Your village is so large, it's strange seeing so many people at once. Hi there, I'm Crack. Festivals are so much fun to put together. Come train with Grub and me sometime. Having quick reflexes is good for your body. Hello is always concerned about others. She'll be a great healer. Yo, I bet Ada was fine in her younger days. You can tell, right? Oh, it says here who is romanceable. Look. Scroll down. There's one we haven't met yet. Frere. That is a 12-year-old boy. Um, Garrick? Alright. Fair enough. Ibon? Like, she's cute there, but honestly, her pixel is like, that's a child. <laughs> but she's cute there, but alright. I gave her poop, she hates it. It's probably not gonna happen. Illo. Again, thought you were a child. Um, sure. Gelrod. Hi, I'm Gelrod. He's the musician, right? He seems kind of arrogant. Juck. 
Not for me. Elf vibes. Mana. Okay. Sure. Let's start giving them gifts. Um, what else? Wait, what's a yak one? Oh, that's them. Crack is romanceable. Okay. And then there's another tribe to meet with two romanceables in? Are these the people with fangs? All right, we wait and we wait until we meet them. Evil fanged people and they're romanceable? I'm saving myself. Also, wait, who is this that I haven't met in our tribe? There's someone here I haven't met. That's all of our romanceables in our own village. Definitely going outside the uh, village gates for this for this one. To be honest with you. Here's your tool. Thanks. I love going to recent runs when it rains. Believe it or not, Crawl and I can be fun. Okay, so then I need a uh, flint hammer, right? Ah, water bucket holds more than a water skin with hard wood. I need more flint. Okay. Hey, did you finish your ideas for mounts? Oh. I think animals will let us ride them if we cushion our weight with a blanket. Make sure you gain the animals' trust by giving them gifts, otherwise I think they'll let you ride them. You finished the idea. You met the yuck ones. The people of the sea live to the south of you, friendly. Okay. So I gotta give, uh, give my boars gifts. We're gonna ride a pig. We're gonna ride that pig, boy. <gasps> oh my god. It's as simple as that. Yo. Who am I riding? Pumba. Let's go. Check it out. I thought this was going to be some long, laborious process. I'm riding a pig. Cool. It's definitely faster for getting around. Hey, guys, look. I invented uh, mounting a pig. Look. Aren't you impressed? Check out my, my hog, baby. No? No? Look, be impressed. Hey, um, here's a seashell. This is okay. Wow, okay. Do you know what's also just okay? That reaction to a present. Jeez. Piggy. Would you like to change your mount? Your current mount will go back to its shed. Oh, cool. Alright, let me water my plants. I love making clothes for the clan, but gathering things, it's fun to mix it up. Um, is this not you? I have more belts to exchange if you need to carry more things. So what, how do we do that? Do I... We exchange. Ah, bigger belt for contribution. <gasps> Fluffy collared coat. 2,800. Hard rock. Key item. What are these key items for? Under wraps. The white wolf. Clothing that makes you have a strange affinity to the name Geralt. Like the Witcher. Warm. Maybe you need those to go in like snow. Clothing that makes you howl. A bunny hat. A cute bear hat. Excuse me. Few can bear how cute this hat is. Well, I need that. An eye patch. Horned hat, kitty hat, smiley hat. These can't all be key items. Why do I have a coconut hat? Why is there a tick on a coconut hat? Why do I have that? It's not nuts, it's coconuts. Okay. Wow, I'm uh, kind of broke when it comes to contribution then. Um... But, yeah, I could use that bigger belt. Time to start putting a lot more in the contribution box, I think. So we can afford some of these things. 
to make her life easier and by easier I mean more stylish, darling. Sleep. Wonder when these fanged hotties are gonna show up. Man, this other tribe better be smoking hot. The romance options in my own village are not good. Calling your mount. Mary's learned how to track time, is ready to build. Carl and I added horns around the land to help call your mount. Cool. Let's head out to start our day. I'm going wait for Grandma to wake up so we can talk to her about the old sundial there. Oh, are my tomatoes done? Man, do you know how good these would taste? Like fresh food? I mean, it's like one of those things we don't experience enough. Fresh food is literally... It tastes a million times better than what we buy. Kuro, the sun's revealed how to harness the power of time. Build a monument to honor him. Tracking its shadow. Okay, where do I want a sundial? This doesn't seem like the kind of thing I'm going to use much, so I'm going to plonk it over here. Yep. Stick it up. That's great. Alright. We're on. We're on for sundialing. I tell you what, Grandma. You better start working on a sprinkler, because I don't have much of a farm here, and I tell you what. I'm already sick of squirting all over these crops. Every time I need to water them. I need something that's just going to sploosh all over these things, you know? Let's get it going. Taking an age in a day. It's actually not that bad. I'm just complaining to fill the time where I'm watering these crops, to be honest, to... Uh, Things interesting. Um, let's get some seeds in. Okay, okay, okay. Switch. Whack, whack. Plonk and sploosh. All right. Done there. Already some stamina gone, honestly. Um, what do I have? Do I have my roots? I have two potatoes and one carrot. I wonder if that's... I wonder if it has to be three of something for me to effectively... Oh, wait. Don't I have an axe now? I guess I could find out. I'm going to wait until I have three of something, though, I think. Three rooted things. I know Atta Sneak's doing Ibon's chores. I'm not sure if I should be mad or not. All right. Can I have my tool I'm waiting for? Oh, I needed to get more flint. Right. Sure. Quinoa seeds. I discovered quinoa. Look at this view. Perfect place for some quinoa to grow. Do you like quinoa? I don't know if I've ever had quinoa, to be honest with you. I had sushi, like, yesterday. And with my sushi, I had some edamame beans. That was pretty nice. Do you like edamame beans? Let's see, what do we got? My inventory's full, but let's go in and get some flint. All right, let's uh, try and knock this baby down with a flint axe. Get out of the way, bush. Oh, I have to use the thing. There you go. All right, what's behind door number one? Inventory full. Is that hardwood? We need hardwood. Let me uh, drop that. It is hardwood. Okay. Yes. Okay. Hello, hello. I wanted to find out what Owl likes before he accepts you. I think I saw a hunt in the previous rooms. You could take a look. I believe it was three roots, was it not? Would you like a tomato, Mr. Owl? No. A bean? 
No. A rose hip? No. I'll come back when I have roots then. Thanks. Just gonna walk out of here holding these rose hips on my head like some sort of tropical fruit basket. Um, can I dance with them on my head? No, nope, I put them down. All right, let's get some more flint and then go back. Bum, bum, bum. Use up our stamina for the day. I'm really enjoying this. I haven't played a game like this in a long time. Probably the last one that I played like this was um, Coral Island, which did not grab me as much. I think Coral Island I would have really got into if it was finished. But as soon as I found out that it was still very early access and there was no romance and there's no mermaids and there's no stuff that really makes it a bit more interesting and some of the writing was a bit squiffy, um, then I was kind of like, I'll come back in a year. I'll save it. But, um, yeah, enjoying this, it's, you know. Always enjoy this kind of thing. What are, the, what are the other good games that are like this? If you're enjoying this, let me know in a comment what else I should play that is like this. If it's not Stardew, or if I should do another Stardew, I don't know. Do a YouTube Stardew run. I did a full playthrough. Did I do a full playthrough? I think I did. Oh, I can't remember the ending. But um, I'm pretty sure I did a full playthrough few years ago now on stream. The first time I played Stardew, I got overwhelmed and gave up. And then I went back to it and I was like, I'm just going to chill. I'm not going to min-max anything. I'm going to have pretty little crop areas that I can manage. And I'm going to relax. And I'm going to enjoy what I'm playing. And I had a really good time. And I streamed it for like, I don't know, 10 days, two weeks, something like that. And then we finally finished it. That's cool. Didn't mean to bonk you with a stone. Can I hold a torch whilst I ride you? Yes, nice. Um, yeah, and finished it and really enjoyed it. So, I don't know. It might be fun to do something eventually. There's a lot of games out at the moment. So I'll prioritise new stuff. But if there's ever a rainy day season, as in nothing's really coming out. I'd love to try a bit of Stardew on here and see how it goes. Let me know if you want to see it, I guess. these tomatoes because I need me some tribute. This is a tribute, yeah. And now we go back to bed. Let's see what tomorrow brings. get some of those outfits. 500, I'm pretty far away. I need to get some more substantial things to give to contribute, I think. Hmm. <gasps> New people. You don't look like a yak one. I'm not. Do you need help, old man? Old man. Is this the body of an old man? Sorry. Shouldn't disrespect my elders. <laughs> That's it. Strength battle. <laughs> oh dear. What's happening? Oh, are you the other tribe? Are you romanceable? Hey, how's it going? Just our brother being our brother. Let's see what's on the other side. You have a waterfall and you haven't even jumped off it. I was thinking about it. you were. The 
this is a lot of people. Too many to be Yak one. It's their enemies. We're Patchens. Aren't you a little far from home? Patcher called us to this place. I see. And be careful of the Yak ones. They can be seen around this area. Inza is... She's gone. One was here. You have to be careful. They hide their tentacles well. Our last keeper was attacked by them. We don't talk about that. Sorry. So it's like the tribalism of how they see each other. Oh, they have fangs. Stay away from them. Oh, they have tentacles, but really they're just humans and they would get along. I'm Zeta. Zeta? Let's call you Zeta. Leader of the Magrani. And I'm Jin, the leader here. I hope our clans can be friends. Your beautiful fire tells me that Kuro is pleased with you. I think we'll get along well. Just beware those yak ones. They can't be trusted. Thank you. We'll consider your warning. Yak one. Hello, newbie. Hi, I'm Valor. My siblings seem to think they need to watch me, but I can take care of myself. Wanna dance? No. Oh, we're not there yet, it's fine. Um, hang on, I just put something in here. Ah, oh, it's gone, damn it, it's the next day. Um, I'll be right back. <laughs> Oh god, get out the way. Trips in the flower bed, face full of dirt. Oh, oh, oh. Uh, hello. Um, would you like a flower? To, to welcome you to the to the village? Thanks. You're welcome. I'm Zeta, leader of the Magrani. We still don't know how to trade with other clans. Wow, like diplomacy is a thing. Okay. You met the Mograni, the people of fire, live to the north, the ones at odds with the Yakwan. Some of our animals can produce milk. You can now get a container from Acre to milk them. Uh, I mean, I got an, I got one of them like Ramo things. I don't think them or my boar are gonna like being milked very much though. It's bean. Check everyone's happy. Oh wait, hang on. Can I make sure you've got food here? Ah, there we go. I mean, there's plenty of food outside, but you know, can I raid you as well? I feel like you're a little bit quicker actually. An Ibex, an Ibex, cookies and cream Ibex. I scream, you scream, we all Ibex scream. Um, Becky, the Ibex. And there's another one here somewhere. Uh, light brown Ibex, well fed. We'll call you. Uh, Beckonese, because man's got crazy hay fever right now, you know, put some nasal spray up there, Beckonese, nasal spray. And, uh, there you go. I beck, I beckon it. I Beckonese. Beck, 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 beck. Alright. What are we doing with ourselves today? I am saving stuff for the owl god. I'll go talk to the lady that dipped out of here off to the south because she had a little exclamation mark on her head when she ran away so we'll go see that she's okay and what she thinks about everything and be like hey they're not scary they're actually kind of cute 
Uh, come hang out. See their village too, why not? Down in the desert here somewhere. New seeds. Kale. Oh, I used to really like kale. I haven't had it in ages, but went through a period of having like fried up kale a lot. It's cute. Not ready to harvest a pink shell. Well, that's bloody cute, isn't it? all the way over there. I'm so tired of my inventory being full. Should put more stuff in storage. Um, how do we get to you? There's a big cave up there too. Oh yeah, I wonder what fish you have here. Do you know what? My inventory's full. I don't even want to see it. I'll come back. Just because I'm the Aquaman leader doesn't mean I have to stay on this island. That's why Brub and I created the council. Oh. Maybe you just had an exclamation mark as like a... Boing! Metal Gear Solid, like being scared and... Alert and going away. Well, at least we came down here and experienced the sandy beaches. Let's see what this next cave is. A different cave. Hmm. Probably need to finish the previous one, but let's hit these and see if something happens. Need a stronger tool, okay. The flint axe, probably. I mean, the flint, um... The next bonker. Home, Becky. A new kind of competition. Why run when you can race? Gelrod saw you riding an animal and wants to talk to you. But he does. Kroll's finished building the sundial. Let's go have a look. <gasps> I have a time up here now. Look, it's six in the morning. Man, do you know what? My life was so much better before I knew what time it was. Now I know that I wake up at 6 a.m. Everything's ruined. Now I'm going to be looking up there and be like, oh, it's 7 p.m. I better start getting back. I was just living my life loosey-goosey before this. Not thinking about any time now I live by the sundial. What have you done to me, Grandma? You've ruined, you've ruined this. Get rid of it. Get rid of it. Go back to basics. All clocks are banned on the island. On Bear Island, no clocks are allowed. We shall, we shall simply decide what is happening by vibe alone. We shall vibe whether it's dinner time. We shall vibe whether it's bedtime, okay? That is how things will occur. Hit subscribe to uh, join the cult and get your early signing up for the uh, early bear deal for cult life. Oh, oh, wild carrots are different to carrots. A root. I need roots. We'll grow some more. Gel rod. Jelly. Jelly boy. I saw you riding that animal of yours. I thought Mana and I could have a little friendly competition to see who could ride them the fastest. Let's go have some fun. Alright. Oh. This is the spot I think will be perfect to race. You all can go down there and I'll instruct you how to do it from here. Instruct us. Why don't you join us? I want to give people a chance to win. So you're afraid to lose? That's ridiculous. So wait, am I going to have to breathe like a super fast mount to win this race? Because this one, I don't know. 
We have an ostrich. A sprint. <gasps> Whoa! Actually racing. Wait, disabled? So I went off the road? Why's my mount disabled now? What, what is happening? Ow! Ow! I want to win. What's that little shortcut you took? Oh my god, skills. Come on, boy. Come on, boy. Come on, Becky. Come on, Becky the Ibexi. Where's the finish line? Becky's dust. Eat Becky's dust. Come on. <gasps> there it is. Oh my god, I actually won my first race ever. Great race. Next time, make sure you give yourself more space on the corners. And why exactly should we listen to you? So you can improve. Then race me. Fine. Don't cry when you lose. That won't be a problem. This is too easy. You gotta at least try it and catch up. Is something gonna happen? Someone gonna hurt themselves? Oh. Humbled. myself enough space on the corners. Whatever. Don't be like that. It's just a race. He just needs some practice. Doing this more often would be fun. I think Reese and others would want to join. And probably Jellrod once he calms down. How about Jizu and I organize some friendly competitions every other Saturday? So we can do this every other Saturday now, huh? Racing. A new achievement is ready to be sculpted. Huh? In the jungle? I don't have much stamina, but let's go see if that's something I can do. Wait. Oh, I wanted to get another tool. I forgot that when I got the flint. I went and got the flint and then I forgot to order my next tool with her. It's not going to be ready for another day. I went the wrong way here. Got to go back up. You, let's go. Da -da. Wait. Get these seeds. You know what? Let's swing by home really quickly, get the flint that we need to make a tool. Okay. Smoked some fish there. Um, flint hammer. I need wood. Ugh, hang on. Just left it in here. So I never put stuff away because you always, as soon as you put it away, you need it. You know? Such is life. Interesting tool. A few precise hits with my hammer here and there, and a bit of chiseling. Thanks. Alright, I've got to get to the jungle quick. Above this line. There we go. What is sculpting? We're going to sculpt some stuff. Oh. 
Thought I could still sprint for some reason. Not in a race anymore, are we? You tread into the jungle. Mounted through the jungle. So, befriending beasts, all prophecies realized. Some animals wanted to live with them. They traveled far with the help of the animals. Some animals greeted them like a friend. They competed to show whose animal was the fastest. Ah, right. What's this? Gentle Touch Bangle. <laughs> the new album, Gentle Touch Bangle. Ooh, where's that go? Gentle Touch Bangle. Is this like... Uh, oh, hello. Imbued with a power that gives more friendship when attuning an animal. Plus five animal friendship. Sweet. The strong energy of this accessory causes it to bind to you when equipped, and you'll have to wait until tomorrow to take it off. I guess to just stop you switching stuff around all the time. It's fine. What's the last one here? Animals of Pacha abounded. One with the wild. I guess I've got to discover more animals. Since the plant one was discovery. And then we'll have a next thing. It's cool. It, it genuinely makes me want to progress and do stuff. I think I did all of the um, community center when I did my Stardew playthrough as well. It's definitely something that makes you want to do it. And I'm usually not a collector, but that kind of thing in this kind of game is very compelling, I find. It's where I want to wanna do it. I want to complete it. You get my fish. Leave that one till tomorrow. I'm really needing to collect quite a bit of uh, favor here. I don't even know where the favor has gone. I apparently spent a bunch, and I, I have no idea why. But, um... Let's go to bed. That was a pretty good total. So definitely catching fish. Smoking and drying them seems to be good for you. Scootaloo. One smoked porcupine. Porcupine. One smoked porky pig. Okay, now I've got carrots and stuff, so I can definitely do that next root thing. Good quality, too. wonder why those ones are good quality ones. Alright, so I got four potatoes. Let me take a blue fish, put my stone away, put my flint away, put this fiber and wood away. I don't want to give three good carrots. I wonder if it'll accept these ones. And let's go into the thing and see if it works. Okay. Resist the urge to pick all those things and fill up your inventory because you need to go in a cave, go in a cave and go in a cave, jump up your mount and go in a cave. If I use this this time. The Owl Preamble. Sounds like a costume party. So if we go in here, Mr. Owl, I do believe that you like a potato. The totem accepts the offering. I think you want three potatoes. No. Okay, you want three different roots? You don't want a carrot? Wait. 
You want a fish. The totem accepts the offering. What about a tic tac fish? Damn it. A mushroom? What's the other thing that you want? One more thing. Hmm. Well, that's all that's in my pocket, but... <sighs> that is very clearly a potato and a carrot, is it not? We're rooting for you. It's two carrots and a potato. Like, is that a- that is a carrot, right? It look, look, literally looks like this. And then what was the one that had the fish? It was like different colored fish on it. And one just back here. Maybe I'm missing a wall. Maybe it's fish, root, and then there's something else. Another wall of some kind. What is it? What do you need? Uh... Oh, I guess I can look for that symbol, the G symbol, and then I'll see. Whatever's on there is what we need to do. So. Ah. Oh, so I need another pine cone or pomegranate. Well, those are right outside, so... Alright, back with a pine cone. The totem accepts the offering. Are you ready? 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 Sure. You may borrow my power with the round platforms. You'll need it to complete my challenge. Wait, I don't sound very owl-like. Guide the light by twisting these pillars. Ooh. And return it to me. Good luck, young one. But oh, hoo, hoo, hoo. That's much better. <laughs> Available for voice acting. So what are we doing? Turning pillars. What? I turned into an owl? Awesome. I'm so nervous, I can't watch. I'm trying to get the courage to talk to Owl. Oh, I'm such a huge fan. Well, where is the light gonna come from initially? Here. Is this where it starts though? So there's a light coming from here, and we need to move it around. The, the classic puzzle, the puzzle of every Tomb Raider, every Uncharted, every cave game to ever have caved. from where they want to go. Sure. I don't quite know where I want to go. But... Move it this way and that way. Every which way, way, way. Flying around. Okay, that's probably what we want. Uh... Oh, no, I was not ready to turn back into an owl, although one might say I just morphed. Let's, um,. Thing. 
Pushkiao. I'm so good at bending light. I'm very confused. Can I go up now? Ah! You who have done well, young one. It's through your observations of the world that my light was returned. Go forth and help others to see their own light. It's a pigeon. Use this map to guide you in caves. Alright. You are ready to use my power elsewhere. I can be an owl anywhere I want. Maybe just on those blocks, but it's pretty cool. Thanks, Mr. Owl. I knew you could make it, Murphy. Owl seemed impressed, too. Nice. One totem done. Flint hammer finished. Oh, it's 4pm. I was in here overnight. I have all my stamina back, too. Let's head back. Imagine they're like, It's been six years since you went into that cave, my boy. Look at my mount just waiting there like a dog at a Japanese train station. It's a new day in Patcha World. Finally, some rain, so I don't have to water all of these crops. And I have some more to plant, so I'm gonna go ahead and stick these in. Slowly just turn this into a full-on tomato field, I think. That race was embarrassing. Maybe I'm better off finding a new clan. That'd be ridiculous. I know, but thanks. <gasps> we can talk to people to get hearts too. Rain is the best. Sure is, especially in the background of my podcast, Down to Sleep, where I read audiobooks to help you get down to sleep. Here's your new tool. Build a house. I know it's using some... Uh... Oh, look, I, I can live literally just next door. Be like, I don't want to move too far away from my grandparents, do I? I think being on the beach, quite nice. Two days to build it, up. Get me own place. More tomato seeds. I should really start visiting that other tribe every day and gifting the person, because it'd be good to like explore the romance in this and see what's up. Wow, so I'll tell you something I love here is I'm just moving this well, and look, you can hold to ignore grid, so if it's like here, if you were saying, oh look, it's, you know, I want it to be there, but it's not symmetrical. How great is that? And you can put stuff wherever you want? Oh my god, it's awesome. So I wonder if I could have it. That's so cool! I don't actually know where to put it. I think I'm going to put it here once there are pathways around the other way. I love that. I mean, that is something that so many people have wanted in so many other games. And it just never, um, never happens, right? What are these that they have over this way? Garlic. Ah. There's so many new seeds to find. I wonder if this is a different, um, I have no stamina, but I wonder if this is different to the grass that we have. Different animals. A new achievement ready to be sculpted. This was the other animal I had to discover. These will be what you can milk, right? Uh, what is this place? I, th I was trying to find the other, um, fire tribe. Oh my god, a big baobab tree. 
Oh, it's getting to be night time. Just wanted to check out the bow app because these are usually like important. Oh, is that a feather? Stretch feather. Okay, we should get back. Should have brought my mount, really. Ostriches, too. Oh my god, I could ride one. Let me play you a song, because that would be a really cool mount. I would have to upgrade my shed, though. It is a big harvest day. Just harvested all of these tomatoes. We've got a bunch of beans. Bean knowledge. Knowledge of the bean. I wonder if, actually, we would get more if we make the effort of... Can I, like... There we go, we can put tomatoes in there. Can I smoke tomato? No. Maybe if we do that first, before we put them in the box, we'll get even more contribution, because it's like preparing it. We make it like a dried vegetable. Could be an idea, couldn't it? I would like to upgrade my water bucket. 20 hard wood. Alright, that's a thing to do then. Having lights around the village is going to be so pretty and helpful. Building lights now. Do you like a bean? It's okay. <laughs> How about you? Do you like a bean? Shiny. Let's go make that sculpture in the jungle and see what item we get and what perk. I think we've done all of the animal one now. One with the wild. Let's see what we get. Bum, 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 bum. Earring of the will. Imbued with a power that increases max stamina. Yes. Increase riding speed when mounted. Fish catching, animal friendship, and max stamina plus 15. Love that for us. I'm going to try building um, a fence, I think. Wood gate, hardwood gate, wood fence, stone fence, smoker, cellar dryer. I think I'm going to go with wood because we already have... Uh, stone force. So that'd be like a nice difference. Do you know what? I feel like I'm going to elongate this first. More space in a big crop. But not too much because I don't want it to look weird with the animal shelter there. And then I'm going to come up this way. gate there to get in if I need to from that side. Hmm. Maybe I clip this side actually, although I kind of could just be like that, couldn't it? Would it be weird if it came on the outside? I think it might be. I think. But then I would have to clip both sides to make it symmetrical. Or maybe, no, maybe it's a walk-in from this side. Maybe it doesn't have to go all the way around, actually. I think I like that better. I don't want everything to be a box, right? That's kind of the thing that we want to avoid in these situations. And that kind of just snugs that, makes it feel a little bit... Yeah. I like that. I like that a lot. And then maybe we try out our scythe here. I've actually used this. Oh, wait, no, this is shears. Oh, I thought I had a better scythe for cutting down the weeds. It's got to be the next tool, right? I mean, look at this place. 
fun fact is my hair was very much looking like this character still not too long ago. And then I went and got it cut, but my hair was the longest, the longest it's been for a long time recently. And I have really thick hair, so it kind of does go very curly. I have like thick curly hair, so it's very much up and out in that way, rather than like long down hair. So it's kind of looking like this character, to be honest with you. Let's put some more tomatoes in to dry. Put some of this stuff in there. Pick up these ones and give some tribute. Wait, that's a raw one. Damn it. I can take it out, it's fine. Okay, so a sun-dried tomato is worth 13. And give you 18 stamina. And a wild tomato is plus 8 stamina. And only gives you 9 tribute. So it does help a little bit. Very slightly. Really not by too much, honestly. My house is ready. The Great Connector. There was another rumbling in the jungle. This area wasn't here before. I've never seen trees like this either. Is that a... fire pit? We should check the paintings. Years passed until all they could remember was their disdain for each other. Tired and sad, Patra shook the earth to show what could be achieved by working together. Have the sun and the moon be one again. The sun and moon? Those drawings are new. There has to be more to this story. Whatever we're doing seems to be working. So it feels like it's about people coming together, tribes that think differently of each other. Just as sometimes we do, guys. We're all one. Patcher is showing us something. I wish I understood more. Do you know what I understand is that you need a sun-dried tomato. Patcher appreciates all things and so shall I. That little spiddle-ink made me think maybe he likes it. Wonder what that area was for, for a fire pit. You gotta light it up. Let's go check out my new house. Place to call my own in the world, a place to call my home, and invite the wife to move into and have a baby. Maybe I don't know if you can actually have a baby. Remove. Leave it up. You can cook at the patch and hearth or your house if you build one. The recipes you can make depend on the utensils you have. You can get more utensils from Taylor, become available as your clan prospers. Select a recipe. I can cook here. Eggplant, grains, fats, squash, any harvest. Carrots, any vegetable and legume. Wait, do some cooking. Wow. A mixed salad. I'm a modern man. Oh, wait. Why? No, I don't want that there. I can just put whatever I want there. Oh, no, wait. Oh, God. What am I doing? Um... Drop these for a second. What did I drop? Small leather rug. Okay. Bum, 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 bum. So I can cook there too. 
and here. Okay. Decorate. Plant style. Oh. Flowers. I like those ones. Decorate with, oh, grain. Boring. A lid. What the? A flower. I'll just have lots of flowers. Cool. Got me own ass now. Kroll's finished building. Thanks, mate. Clan added torches to all buildings. It's easy to find the way home at night. Now you have a place of your own, it's time to decorate it. Reese has goods you might like. Okay. Very cool. No more food ready today. I will give a mixed salad to tribute. Let me see what it's worth. 13! But it gives me 38 stamina, so absolutely not worth tribute. Because that's the exact same as one sun-dried tomato. So I'll keep that as a little salad boost for my day. Um, oh yeah, I wanted to upgrade my water bucket with you. It takes 250 contribution. I don't care about my water that much right now. Let's explore this area a little more. See if there's any other new things here. Be a lot quicker now I have my mount. What are these? Cats? <gasps> oh, it's a cave lion. I mean, it's kind of a cat. It's a cute little cave lion, isn't it? So I can have a pet cat. What's this? Horns. Definitely going to be something that you do with those ants. Can't be an ant hill for no reason. Hello, ostriches. Where's my ostrich that needs singing to today? Hello, darling. feel like you'll be a really quick mount let me on top if you trust me I'll let you sleep in the shed with my pigs it's not gonna flop Do you trust me yet? no a bit longer eh? Care about these horns actually. A material made of keratin, great for carving. Gatherable animal produce. <gasps> oh my god, mammoths. Woolly mammoths. How cool. Hi, buddy. How you doing? Can I give you a little nose rub or something? Play a flute for you? You know? <gasps> Look at the baby. Oh my god, we can play the flute for the baby. I can have a pet woolly mammoth. I guess we have to get it when it's a baby, the others are too big. Literally distracted by how cute these other ones are that are coming along. Missed one. How's it going? Some in my clan want revenge for the disrespect the Aquans paid to one of ours. But our power is for protection. We've never been aggressors. Small talk with strangers isn't my thing. But I'm 
whatever your name is. What fruits up this tree? A wild almond. Oh, you guys got eggs here? Is, uh... The lady of the house home? Small bones. Can't collect those. Where is she? Over there somewhere. Oh, hey. Imagine finding you here. Have you been to the jungle? Air shouldn't be that wet or hot. <laughs> Tell me about it. Um, do you like, do you like, do you like, um, do you want a salad that I made? Wait, I can't give it, do you want this? Thanks. <laughs> Did she like the salad? It's time to find out if she likes the salad. She's neutral on salad. All right, we'll try again tomorrow. She's neutral on the salad. Repeat, she is neutral on the salad. Probably should have given her the bone. If you made it all the way here to the end of this video, Thank you so much for watching. It truly means the world to me that you enjoy this enough to have watched or left it on in the background all the way through. However you've ended up here, thank you for being here. Please do hit that like and subscribe if you haven't already, and I will see you in the next one. Have a beautiful day.